Okay, hey everybody. So, I'm doing, this is going to be pre-recorded, so that way I have content for when I get really busy during the week. <clears throat> and that way I can, <laughs> that way I can stay a happy Russ instead of a mean old grump. <clears throat> so, this first one is kind of like a small tote, um, but there's some really good yarn in here. So, let's see what we got. It's not as big of a tote as I normally have, but like I said, there's a lot of good yarn in here. So, I was at, I think, Big Lots, and they had this, um, it's a 50 gram ball. And it was distributed by Premier Yarns. It's mixed fiber, and that's all the label says. It doesn't tell you what hook to use. It doesn't tell you nothing. But it's a nice yarn. It's a, it's a really good yarn. Let's see. I'm trying to... Hold on just a second. Okay. There. Oh, I'm going to have to turn the other light off. Hold on. There we go. Much better. Oh, what a horrible, horrible beginning. But it just goes to show you guys, life happens. It happens. So why go back through and edit all that? You know firsthand. Life gets in the way. These little things happen. If you wanted to watch a perfect um, filming, you'd turn on the TV and watch a movie. Right or wrong. So, let's get back to this. So, it's still a little bright. But this is like a cream color. Okay? And it was like a dollar. And I got like 20 of them. There's like 20 of them in this um, bag and it's from Premier Yarn and like I said it doesn't say anything on the label other than mixed fiber and the stitch definition is just beautiful it's like why don't you why don't you still make this yarn <laughs> the story of a knitter and crochet right you get a good yarn and it disappears so I've got this beautiful orange. It's just beautiful. Um, it's from um, Lighthouse Yarns. It's the Alpine Valley um, line. And it is a bulky five. I think the only reason why it's a bulky five is because of the halo. To me, it's like a four weight. But I think because of the halo on it, you can see some of the halo. Um, they classify it as a five, but it's 30%. Now I can't, now I can't talk. Oh my goodness. So it is 36% wool, 30% acrylic. 28% nylon and 6% alpaca. It's 1.75 ounces, 50 grams, 120 yards, 110 meters. Um, they want you to use a size 9 knitting needle or a 10.5 millimeter crochet hook, size K. But this is some really soft yarn. And it really has some good stitch def stitch definition. And I believe at one time, I, I believe I bought this from Hirschner's. Moons ago. <laughs> Moons ago. But it smells so clean. This goes to show you, I take good care of my yarn. Um, 
but it's really nice yarn and I love the color. The color is just gorgeous. But I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 15. So that's 1,500 yards, over 1,500 yards, because it's 110 yards. So 1,600, 1,650 yards, if my math is right, you could make a really, really nice um, shawl out of that, or a nice wrap. So, now, oh my goodness, <laughs> if this don't tell you how old I am, oh my goodness. So, most of you will know, because most of you have been, been knitting and crocheting for a long time, but look at that, Lion Brand Suede. Okay, this was expensive yarn when it was out. Um, let's see, it is, uh, let's see, it's a bulky weight five, and it is a five weight. Um, they want you to use a nine knitting needle, and they want you to use a 10.5 crochet hook. And this color is called coffee. It's a beautiful brown. Hmm, let's see, yardage, yardage. Well, it's 122 yards, 110 meters, it's three ounces or 85 grams. Machine wash, lay flat to dry. So, this on clearance, as you can see, that on clearance was still $5.89 on clearance. So, that goes to show you how expensive this yarn was. It smells clean, but I bought all of it that Joe, this I bought at Joanne's. I bought everything, every, every one that they had, I bought. Um, I was, I was with uh, a friend of mine and it's like, man, they're just, they're clearing this out and you know, I don't, I, I'm not, I didn't, at the time, I really didn't like bulky yarn. And this feels, um, I don't think I said what it was made out of. Because I don't know if it said. 100% polyester. So, it's got that stiffness to it. Um. But it's, it was nice yarn. But it was just expensive because it only has 122 yards. And I'm thinking, you know, I bought this back in 08. Um, because it was right before she moved is when I bought this. So anyhow. $5.89 on clearance back then, that was a lot of money. I mean, this had to be almost like 10 bucks a scheme. So, but I've got two, three, up, four. I got 
five of that color. So that would be plenty to make um, a hat and scarf set. It'd be plenty. And my little sticker has no more sticker. Like I said, I bought this back in 08. And it's been in my collection since. But it smells so clean. So, there's that. Now, I've got one, two, and three of these. Now, what my original thinking was... Um, these browns... I was going to make a blanket out of. I was going to do a um, different color of blanket. So I've got three of that color. Up. Oh. Here we go. We got one more of the coffee. So that made like six coffee and three of the light brown. Now, here's this color, this beautiful sand, but I'm not sure if that's the color. It's called taupe, okay? So I've got four of those, which would go with the blanket, with the browns. So I've got six, nine, 12 of them. And now these, and all this was bought at the same time because it's all on clearance for five eighty nine. And I've got these beautiful blues. And um, my friend Lisa, she would love these blues. But she lives in the UK. I can't send them to her. Um, so I've got three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, I got nine. Nine of that color. Oh. Let's see what color this one is. This is denim. So the blue is denim. Now, I've got this beautiful color. Now, I know it's showing up a little bit lighter, but this is a, like a dark purple. It's called fuchsia, is the color. And on my computer, on my phone, it's showing um, it's showing it's actually darker than what it's showing on my screen. So if your screen is showing a dark. A dark bur like burgundy then it's the correct color but it's called fuchsia so I've got one I got two three four five six seven eight Nine, ten, eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. So there's fourteen of them. So I have plenty to make um, a solid color. And the stitch definition of that is just beautiful. Um, so if, so if you like polyester, you would have loved this yarn. They do not make this anymore. Um, it, it's, it was really nice yarn, but it was expensive. Even for back in that time period, 
yarn was fairly cheap, way cheaper than it is now. That was 12, 15 years. <laughs> that was 15 years ago. Um, so, yeah, it, it was a nice yarn, but it was too expensive. Um, but, anyhow, I want to thank you guys. This, this was, you know, it was a small tote and, but it's still 15 minutes long. Even though I had to wrap up the beginning. Jumping up and down, up and down, trying to get the light. But anyhow, I love you guys. And I will see you in my next video, okay?